What did you ask me for? Katie asked if uh, I would help her build a, a Jeep that her and her daddy had at the house. Um, Sergeant Salisbury and I went over to the house and part for the course for Corby. It would have took me five years to put that Jeep together because it was in coffee cans and boxes. And I saw a picture on Pinterest and it was like this car and I showed it to my mom like, I don't even know how long ago. Georgiana and I got together and, and decided we were gonna do it, take on a project, something a little newer, more safe. And uh, we found this Jeep and the rest is history. That's yours. Come on. I thought it was just like a school event or something because there were a lot of people like standing around and, and then my mom like pulled in and then I saw like the cop cars. When she turned 16, this is her party. You know, we, we just know how to throw a party. <laughs> they just want to like, I don't know, support me and since like my dad can't anymore. It's the second family kind of thing. <laughs> so we are a family. Father, we ask you to uh, keep these four wheels on the ground. Love you. Jesus precious name. Corby would say, without a doubt, let's go put that sucker in four-wheel drive and we'd be out in these cotton fields tearing this thing up, is what Corby would say. Knowing my dad, he'd be like, really? Okay, whatever. Just my dad being my dad. If Corby drove one in high school, so will she. I'm gonna go show it off and make everyone jealous. <laughs> All those hairy-legged boys out here are gonna be <laughs> That's right. I miss you. <laughs> Love you. We got it, bro. We'll see you soon.